Hey, Epic Life Church, Pastor Mike here, pastor, uh, senior pastor of Epic Life Church in Terrell, Texas. I want to give you a quick word this morning. Um, I hope you're having a great Thursday, Uh, but I want to share a word with you that I was having a conversation with a young couple um, last night or yesterday, and we got onto the topic of forgiveness. And I cannot tell you the importance of forgiveness. This is the statement that I made with them. And I want to make this statement with you. I want you to hear this in my heart. I think forgiveness is one of the major issues that our country struggles with. I think it's the leading cause for divorce. I think it's the leading cause for war. Uh, Forgiveness is one of the essential ingredients of being a believer. So I said to them, I made this statement. When you don't forgive, when we don't forgive, we place ourselves, I want you to hear me now, under a curse. Because the Bible says this, I want to read this, it's out of Matthew chapter 6, verse 14. I want you to hear these words. This is Jesus, Yeshua speaking. He says, for if you, if you would forgive all other people their transgressions, Your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you would not forgive all other people, neither will your Father forgive your sins. Did you see that? Did you see the curse? The curse is when we willingly choose not to forgive those that have offended us, those that have violated us, those that have... Uh, whatever it is that have come against you, come against me, when we do not do that, we put ourselves under the curse. What is the curse? It says it in verse 15. If you would not forgive all other people, neither will your Father forgive you. Church, I want to give you an encouragement this morning. Whatever it is you need to work through, whatever it is that you need to let go of, start with forgiveness. Forgiveness is not for the captor. The forgiveness is not for the violator. The, the, the forgiveness is not for the trespasser. It's for you. It's so that you walk in the fullness of the grace and mercy and forgiveness that God has offered us so that you can live a life of freedom. I want to give that to you this morning. I hope you will share this with as many people as you can. I love you. And I want to see you live out the life that you were created to live, that epic life. Walk with forgiveness. Live in forgiveness. God bless you.